Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Steve Freeman coming at you live from Zombies Bar here in San Antonio. Tonight, guys, we're going to be making my take of an old fashioned. Okay, for tonight's ingredients, we're going to be using Basil Hayden's whiskey. It's delicious. We're also going to be using some simple syrup. We're going to be using bitters and we're going to be using a little bit of cherry juice. These are our ingredients for our drink tonight, guys. Let's get to making your drink. Okay, guys, now to make this drink, you want to grab your glass. We're going to add about uh, maybe eight to 10 ice cubes. You don't want to fill it up all the way. It's not a, it's not a real big drink. This is more kind of a sip and drink. Okay. The first thing you want to do, we got our basil Hayden's. We're going to put in an ounce and a half. Okay. We'll probably drip some on the map there for extra stuff. Next, you're going to put a quarter of an ounce of simple syrup, just a little bit. Okay. Just a little bit more. Okay. Normally, People make old fashions with sugar cubes. They, they muddle them down and do stuff like that. I like to use a little bit of the simple syrup just for sometimes the sweetness of it. Then we're going to add three drops of bitters. Okay. You only want to do two to three drops of the bitters. It's, it's, that's what makes an old fashioned. If you do too little, it's not going to taste right. You do more, it's going to taste wrong as well. Now, what I like to do also, a lot of people like to add an orange and uh, the peel and some other stuff. I like to add a little bit of cherry juice, actually, to give it a little bit more of a sweetness. And not too much, just enough to get in there, just like that. And I like to take a straw, just mix it around just like this. Okay. Now, this is my take, guys on an old-fashioned. There's a lot of people that make them different ways, but this is just my take. Now, this is a Zombies Bar old-fashioned. I hope you guys enjoyed making the Zombies Bar version of our Old Fashioned. If you guys like what I'm doing, man, hit the like button and hit the subscribe button down below. If you guys make your Old Fashioned a certain way, please put it in the comments section. I'd like to see the ingredients and how you guys make it. Until our next video, guys, I'll see you then.